Good evening, Keller Williams, and welcome back to the KW Command 66 Day Challenge 4.0, and today is day 12. Wanted to talk a little bit about today. I've had a few people reach out and say they're not seeing their leads come into their contact database. Um, and obviously, there's a couple of different issues that are happening there, but one of the more prevalent ones that, that I've seen is those that have a team, uh, they have not built out a lead route. So that's what we're going to talk about a little bit today, how to build out a lead route to make sure that your Facebook leads are then getting appropriately uh, routed and also that you're getting the notifications from that lead route. So in order to build out a lead route, we're actually going to come up to the right of our name, click on the drop down box and choose settings. Now, if you are not on a team, you will not see lead routes show up. So lead routes are only if you are on a team. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and select my team and a heads up only the Rainmaker can build out the actual routes. Um, what I have seen though is a lot of people have a team quote unquote and it's them and their wife or them and an assistant or a transaction coordinator that's licensed and on their team. If you have more than one person you have a team set up in the team tool you are on a team and would need to build a route for your Facebook leads in order to get those to come back to you in your command database and not default to the lead pool. So in order to build a route, we're gonna click on lead route and you can see that this showed up once I selected my team. So if I don't have my team selected, you can see lead routing is not there. Again, you do have to be the rainmaker in order to build out these lead routes. So I'm gonna click on lead routing and then choose routes. From there, I can click on create a new route and I get to title what that route is, just so I know what it is. So let's just say uh, Facebook Leads 66 4.0. Um, there are three routing rules right now. So the first two are somewhat similar, the third a little bit different. Random, meaning that the lead is going to be randomly assigned to one or more team members that you select. Weighted random means that you can um, kind of tip the scales a little bit in one person's favor, give them a higher chance of getting the lead than the others. And first come first serve means everybody gets the lead at once. So with random or weighted random, you will see, so I'm gonna go ahead and choose random to start. So we're gonna click on random and then make sure you scroll down. I see a lot of people not doing this step. So first of all, here is when the route's gonna run. So you could set up routes to run differently during the week or on the weekends, during the day and during the evening. You can build out a series of routes, but you can see right now defaults to all days and all times. Um, I'm actually in Central Standard Time, so I'm gonna go ahead and change that just so that's clear and simple. And then the claim action deadline. How long does the agent you're routing this lead to have to claim it before it either A goes to the next agent or B goes into the lead pool? So you would wanna have a discussion with your agents on those expectations, three minutes, five minutes, 10 minutes, you know, kind of depends on what you're looking to have that standard set. So let's just say it's gonna be five minutes. We'll move it up to five and I'll click on next. And then from there, I'm gonna select my lead source. So you can see that this list has been greatly cleaned up. So it's gonna be Facebook ad lead is what I'm looking for. So Facebook ad lead, I'll click on next. And then from there, I can select which agents. Now, again, this was random. So who do I want to receive these leads? If I'm the rainmaker and I'm the only one that I want to receive these leads, or if somebody on my team is the only one receiving Facebook leads, then you would just select that person. If you want more than one person to go back and forth between the leads, then you could select the two of them. So that was random. Now, if I go back, you'll see if we do a weighted random, whoops, let's do weighted random. So we gotta go back in and put that uh, title back in. Um, weighted random. And we're gonna go back through the same thing, five minutes. Let's set the time zone. Let's make sure that it is all day, all times. And it's gonna be the Facebook lead source. I just wanna show you what it looks like when you do that weighted because you can see there's now gonna be a percentage. So I can say, hey, I want it between myself and my wife. I want a higher chance of getting the lead. I want her to have a lower chance. Or you could actually say advanced I want mine to be you know, a 75% chance of getting the lead and her to get a 25% chance. So all things being equal, I would get three, uh, every three leads-ish for every one lead that she's receiving. And obviously you could change this if I wanted to make it um, you know, 66 and then she's 34, so that I'm getting two to every one of her one. 
and so on and so forth, I can save that. Uh, if you do the uh, first come first serve, then there's no weighted because it's just a matter of, okay, it's gonna send the alert to everybody and whoever claims the lead first is the one that gets it. So those are the three different types of routes that you can set up. Again, if you're the only one to be receiving the leads, then you would just come back in and you could just do a random all day, all times, give yourself, I mean, if you're the only one receiving them, give yourself 30 days. I mean, I don't know, you, you could max this out however you wanted. Uh, I'll just put in 30 days here and then go to next, Facebook ad leads, and I'm the only one getting them and save that. So if you're the rainmaker and you're the one receiving those leads, then that would be set up. In the lead ad, or excuse me, in the lead routes, you can see all of the ones that you have selected. Uh, this was a test one I was running, that's not legit. This is the one that I just created for this video, so I don't need to have that one on. This is the actual one that I have set up now. Um, a little while ago, I did have our second lead come in from the Facebook ad that we are running, and I wanted to show you what it looks like when you have a lead route set up. So first of all, I'm gonna get an alert in command that we received a new lead. However, then I get an alert as the agent that those leads are being routed to that says, hey, Marty Miller has sent you a new lead. So I sent myself this lead and then I can come in and claim or pass. So this is place one that I get that notification. Uh, place two, uh, here pretty soon we should all have this available and it's called the new leads widget. And so it would show up here, right? So you would see here's the recent lead that came in. Now I've already claimed this lead, otherwise I would see that lead here. So that's the second place it would show up. The third is that I would actually get an email so I actually received this email again, 5.30, about three hours ago, that I have received a new lead. I basically routed it to myself. So if you're on a team and the Rainmaker is routing leads to you, this is the email you receive. If you're on a team and you're the Rainmaker and you're routing them back to you, well, you'll get your own actual email and then you can click on claim. And what it does is it takes you into command, into the actual contact record and then you can see it. So it says no longer available because I've already claimed it earlier, um, but if it was available, it would have taken me directly into the contact record for this actual new lead. So that's it for lead routing. Um, if you are on a team and you are the Rainmaker, I would highly recommend you set up a lead route, even if it means sending it right back to yourself. Uh, if you are on a team and you are not the Rainmaker, you may wanna have a discussion with your Rainmaker to find out, hey, are we routing the Facebook leads? Who's getting them? Can I get a crack at those, um, et cetera. So this is our new lead. Off camera, I'm gonna go ahead and add the tags, add them to the smart plan, and then add them to the Bridgeland neighborhood that we're in, so we're up to speed on both of those. Hope everyone's having a fantastic Saturday. As always, I will look forward to speaking with you tomorrow. Thanks so much, guys.